Hello and welcome to Butter Chicken Podcast from Istanbul, Turkey. So I'm in Istanbul for 48 hours, so I'm going to be taking you a tour of the city and also telling you places that um, is recommended to visit when you are in Istanbul, so stay tuned. So if you're coming to Istanbul, make sure you check out this Istaklal Street. It's the most happening street here. And you can do a lot of things. You can go for shopping, you can eat delicious food, and check out the local culture. So there's keychains of this uh, evil eye. Um, it's only for two lira. So according to the traditions and culture, it keeps the evil spirits away and uh, keep you in a good shape. So when you come to Turkey, you need to check out their desserts, their sweets. So I'm gonna go to a rooftop restaurant uh, with a beautiful view of this Galata Tower and delicious food. So let's go check it out. So we're getting some fresh juice here, yeah. pomegranate. It's all fresh, right? Only fresh. That's good. Uh, famous shopping, vitamin shop. So these are the rates. So you can get uh, like, you know, apple juice so small for three lira, uh, pineapple for five. So not bad for fresh juice. I'm having a breakfast at this local cafe here. So this is my omelette and my Turkish tea. You know, looks quite delicious. So this is our boat. It's gonna take us on the other side of the Istanbul, which is uh, the Asian side. So we are going to the Asian side of Istanbul. So you like Bollywood movies? Yes, I love it. Bollywood, casual. <laughs> That's good. Nice to meet you. This is popular uh, street food in Istanbul. It's called Midya Dolma. So these are mussels with rice and garlic. So this is. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. <laughs> You got rice too, so it looks delicious. Mm. <laughs> 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 This bridge uh, connects uh, Europe and Asia and now I'm heading towards the European side of Istanbul. So see you on the other side of the bridge. So the most economical way to travel in Istanbul is get this uh, Istanbul card. So you basically pay 20 lira and the card costs 6 lira and then you get a deposit of 14 here. And we can use on tram, uh, ferries, buses so this is the best and the most economical way to travel in Istanbul so you can get the corn for like four years and those uh, delicious chestnut uh, for 100 grams for 10 lira so these are quick snack well, this is Hagia Sophia initially it was built in 537 AD uh, by the Roman Empire and it was used as a church um, Later in Ottoman Empire This place was converted into a mosque and throughout the history of Hagia Sophia It has been used as a place to worship uh, the God the Creator and if you are into the history of Roman and Ottoman Empire, I would highly recommend to check this place uh, when you're here 
the ticket to get into Hagia Sophia is uh, 75 lira. Fun fact about Hagia Sophia, this is the second most visited uh, museum in Turkey. Annually around 3 million people will visit. And this building has been damaged numerous times because of earthquakes because it sits on a fault line. I got my Bosphorus boat tour for only for 25 lira. And one other suggestion that I want to make is that uh, make sure you bring the uh, lira, the Turkish currency with you. It's much easier to do things when you have the local currency. And also avoid booking trips or tours uh, online because they cost almost double. So if I would have booked this um, this tour online, it would have cost me like $50. So right now it only cost me 25 lira, so which is pretty cheap. So make sure you avoid booking things online, buy it local. good place to uh, come for food and also enjoy the view while you eat so if you like kebab a barbecue stuff this is their menu and the prices look pretty decent Teşekkür for watching this vlog of uh, Istanbul. Teşekkür means thank you in Turkish. So if you have any question, uh, feel free to message me on my Instagram. And don't forget to like and subscribe to the Butter Chicken Podcast Facebook page and YouTube channel. Peace.